To call it a sinkhole would be a major understatement. A combination of frozen ground runoff and rain on Friday night caused a nearly one kilometer stretch of Trenier Road to wash away. It came tumbling down the hill and just the volume was too much. It, it just eroded the road. And now that road, which has holes as deep as six meters or the height of an adult giraffe, will be closed for the foreseeable future. It's a matter of filling with rock. We have a lot of rock around here and then sand and then building the surface up, but that takes time. So yes, it's a major project. We haven't costed it yet. Fortunately, nobody lives on that stretch of Trenier, so its closure won't be felt too much. But many other roads nearby have been impacted by water damage. With the budget being discussed by Cramie Township Council this week, some changes may need to be made to deal with it. Do we need to reconfigure where the money's going to go in this next year? Obviously, we have some changes. <laughs> Coburn Hardware, thanks speaking. Meanwhile, it's been very busy at the local hardware store. Many residents who are dealing with flooding on their properties are coming in for supplies. And needless to say, we've been running very low on sump pumps. Um, anything to do with removing water, whether it's, you know, pumps, uh, hoses, like anything. It's been just a constant, you know, barrage. Back on Trenier, the timeline for fixing it is unknown. Priority is given to road projects affecting access to homes. Since Trenier doesn't affect any homes, it could be a while before this is repaired. It won't be done tomorrow, but it will be done. Absolutely. Mark Junta, Global News.